Hey guys, I'm Jane on occasion, and today we are carrying on with our Adeptus Sororitas campaign, and we have our war suits. The paragons of wearing suits that they are. Um, so yeah, pretty cool. I like them. You know, they got their, their life to the Emperor for extra accuracy, but they're mostly going to be stabbing people with swords, so, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm keen. Keen to see them in action. We haven't really seen them do much yet. Um, they will be headed over here to come and help um, destroy... Uh, the home of 22 people. I assume that just means 22 people live there. They they love to have loads of space. I mean, it's Gladius. Like, real estate prices on Gladius must be, like, at an all-time low right now. You know, everyone can afford their own cathedral. So, anyway. Um, yeah, we've got some Battle Sisters. Can hopefully uh, take on some of the random crap we found around. But the tower built yet another city. <laughs> yeah, this is annoying. I don't know what these guys are busy doing. But I feel at some point they're just going to come and attack us again. Um, but it's okay, because we're probably making progress, arguably. We have our own city down here that's doing things. Um, we are about to build another, not a hab block, a, um, Cells Urbis, um, over here, which, you know, will give us more population. So hopefully we can start developing these places, build them up nice and strong. Um, you know, make sure they eat plenty of veg. Uh, let's see, do I actually want to spend the requisition to get another Paragon Warsuit? Because this is a genuine concern um, if we're going to put our upkeep down too much. Because I do need to get loads of requisition because we need to get a load of building done. But like an actual lot of buildings you know, getting built. Uh, I might get some more hospitalers in the queue though because I think I'm going to send them down here and maybe build a city over here somewhere. Or maybe over here and I could go for bonus requisition in this area. There seems to be some more requisition dotted around here and some energy. But yeah, down here might be a good spot for it. Even though it's got all this weird terrain around it. Um, yeah, plus 40% to requisition there. And we get the plus 20% from that. Yeah, okay, if we build here, take over these two, we can we can fill this place up really nicely with requisition. So I think we'll do that. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. Uh, also, yep, yeah, chaos running around. It's whatever, we got an invasion. There's, when don't we have an invasion going? Uh, also, I want to get Celestine. We can afford her right now. Why didn't I think to put her first? Ooh, do I want to do that now? Because that will trigger the next chapter. Once we kill the invaders, but that will probably happen pretty soon. I'm going to get the Hospitalers first, then I'm going to get Celestine. And I'm going to put them both in the queue, so I don't neglect getting Celestine. Alright? I know, everyone's shouting at me, but you said you were going to get Celestine. I'm going to get Celestine, okay? But I think we need another city. You know, I feel like we're behind the curve a little bit here, especially with the beating that Stern's port took. You know, I think we need to sort of power our economy for a bit. We have enough troops in enough places to fight off basically anything that needs fighting, I think. Alright, suffering a bit of damage. Nothing major though. Looks like we can get rid of these guys soon enough. Uh, there's a big scary boy over there. Don't know if you saw that. There was a I forgot what they're called. Forge Fiend is what they're called. I just remembered. <laughs> Honest. Uh, anyway, let's finish them off. And you can get a bunch of damage into them. In fact, we can use our... Well, I might need to keep it for that guy, actually. If he gets close, I'm going to need to hit him with the... The Jikero thing. Look at that. 54 hit points. Yeah, I feel like these guys are a bit ahead of us. Uh, how many hit points do this war suits have? 32. Marvellous. Oh, that's very, very exciting. Um, so we want to kill these guys. I wonder. Yeah, I'm going to attack him with a couple of things. I could just attack him with these guys, though, couldn't I? Yeah, that'll save me some hassle. Alright, let's attack with them. I'll wait for them to die, and these battle sisters can go to here and shoot this guy. Can't quite. Can't quite. Oh, yeah, we can. Good. I just hadn't calculated rapid fire yet. Nice. Um, and then we have our Hospitallers, which I will put in the front line again, where they're safe. Where we're going to pretend that they're safe. And... I mean, I do want to go over here, but I guess um, we've already shot, so I won't. Uh, right, let's get you up here. Let's see what the Forge Fiend is all about. The Forge Fiend demon engine was originally devised to sow death amongst enemy forces from afar, roughly centauroid in form. The torso of the Forge Fiend boasts twin weapon mounts that carry hell-forged parodies of Imperial armaments. 
The most common forged fiends are created with pairs of Hades autocannons in place of their primary limbs, rotary gun clusters that allow them to scythe down masses of enemy troops, and even lightly armored vehicles with contemptuous ease. Sounds like fun. Can't wait to meet them. Um, <laughs> right, let's head down here. And I think they're going to... Okay, good. They're not going to shoot. They only overwatch at a distance, apparently. Uh, sorry, closer distance. Which is kind of the opposite of a distance. Right, let's kill these guys. So, do I want to use this? I would have three turns. So, does that actually do much damage? I'll hang on to it. I'm going to hang on to this. Yeah, I'm going to hang on to that. Um... Ooh, what do I want to do? I think just attack them, honestly. You know, we killed one. Nailed it. Good. Uh, don't know they keep taking this, but we still have the Ruins of Vul there for some reason. Nice of them to leave it there. Uh, so we are getting a tank factory over here, the Anointed Hangar. So that's nice. We will start getting vehicles from over there, provided we can get enough requisition. Grr. Always need more requisition. Uh, we also want these guys to start moving down here. Unfortunately, with the city here, that's not going to be enough, is it? And in fact, we kind of need... Uh, I was looking for my hospitalers. They're there. <laughs> Crap. Okay, we need more hospitalers anyway. If we're going to take this. Ah, crap. Yeah, we need more hospitalers down here. I'm going to have to train another lot of Hospitallers. Um, but what we can do is we can move down with Hospitallers, destroy that, have them come over here to build here, and hopefully by the time this is all done and we get this other settlement up and running, we'll have more Hospitallers down here that can help out too. Okay? That's the plan. It's penciled in, okay? <laughs> we'll see how it goes when it goes. So I think that's kind of it now, right? Yes, have you walking down here. I don't know if we want to go near the city, honestly. Uh, we want to take that back. That's for sure. There are more, like, havocs running around here that are going to be very good against infantry. Which is a little scary. And, oh, that's been taken as well. We are just having our resources eaten into right now, and it's not good. Really not good stuff. Could get some more Zephyrim or Battle Sisters, though. But I think we might leave it for now. Uh, so we are going to have the Ecclesiarchal built in a minute. Which is nice. We can get aircraft and knights. I think they're going to be very useful. Okay, where's he off? Oh, okay. Quite a lot running around. Here's the Havocs. And the Devilfish just took our territory over. Jerks. Oh, we got problems. Um, could ignore them for now. I think we want to get rid of the Havocs more importantly than anything else. Okay, we should be able to mess them up. So we can start with that. And... I mean, we can we can kill them. They're going to they're be able to do some big damage if we let them, so I really do need to make sure they die. So there we go. They're still running around. Right, where were the guys who were up here then? Not sure. Aha! There we go. Much better. They are going to overwatch though, but I don't think they'll get any kills. Nice. Uh, so I can kill them in one go if I grenade them. But it's going to take ten turns to get that back and we may need it. Oh, I'd need these guys dead though. Let's just finish them off nice and quickly. Alright, you head down here. Uh, you start heading for the recaf. Uh, can't shoot that. It's not close enough. We'll be able to get vehicles soon. These guys are probably going to run in at some point, but that's fine. Uh, so I'm going to use Sacral Vigor, I think, in a second. Not just yet, but soon. Alright, let's push you forward completely. There they are. Thought they would be. Which is absolutely fine. Because we can heal. Um, so let's start shooting. In fact... Could use a crack grenade. Melter bombs are very, very good, but they're also going to be very, very good against the, the buildings here, and I kind of want to save it for that instead. Um, I think we'll keep that exorcist there for now. 
You start moving this one in. And you, I guess, can stand over here, actually. It'll heal much quicker here. And we will be able to shoot anything that decides to stand here, which is good. So that'll do. That'll do. Okay. Good. Making progress. Very slow progress. <laughs> but look at this. And what's nice is the upkeep for fighters is energy. So we don't have to worry about having too many of these and it ruining our requisition uh, supply. So let's get a couple of those queued up. It's going to take six turns each. That's okay. Probably. I'm sure they're going to be great. Oh, yeah. More coming in. And we've got the Overwatch already blasting. Nice. Yeah, we may lose a couple Battle Sisters. We can heal them. So, not a problem. Yeah, they're taking big damage. Uh, there's Wireweed there, which is a bit disappointing. Because I really want to get this one in. Uh, okay, so we can move this one back, actually. We can move you back. We can have you shoot, even though I did kind of want you to rest. <laughs> but that's okay. And then we can move the Paragon more suits up. Who are going to absolutely decimate these jumps. Alright, take that, champs. And Gulden Scriptoria is about to die. Come on. There we go. So Zephyrim can move in. Attack them. Oh, they've got an Overwatch. 194 damage we need to do to them. That's going to take some doing. But I feel like we can do it now, you know. The war suits are going to be a big, big boon. And I think they're finally out of steam. They're going to keep sending stuff at us. Like, obviously, but... Uh, yeah, Sacral Vigor again. I want to make sure everyone's healed up as much as possible. And these guys still loitering. Um, let's go with the bonus accuracy. Is it Righteous Judgment? Oh, no, that gives people extra on. That, wait, that's the one I want. That's the one I want. Alright, go get him. Oh, I can't quite. Oh, the extra accuracy. There we go. And there go the Chaos Space Marines. And we're going to take this back as well. Uh, you're going to inch around here. I mean, got to be careful here. I don't know if this is going to block the line of sight from this guy. I kind of want to find out, actually. So, 65 health. It's been under attack. Something has been attacking it, so that's a good sign. So I might be able to sneak in here, grab that, and leave. It'd be pretty good. Just a bit of extra requisition. Yeah, I'd enjoy that. Um, okay, what's building now? Oh yeah, it's Havelock. Yeah, we're going to need that. Because we are kind of maxed out. Uh, down here, you also got small population. We have a slight, you know, slight lead on that, which is nice. Um, okay. We still have this for some reason. That Forge Fiend just went straight past it, which is really sweet of him. But yeah, it does seem like the Tower and Chaos have been bickering. Which is perfect for us. Hopefully they'll keep doing that indefinitely. Okay, moving on. Uh, no, you're good. Or are you? Do we want to get some immolators or something? We could get Paragon Warsuits down here, which would be pretty amazing. But I'm not going to yet. We're going to keep trying to develop things. I think we will also need some more influence to build another city, right? Alright, Zephyrim taking some damage over there. Don't know how well they're going to withstand all this damage. Uh, more Corp Circus. Uh, okay, Zephyrim's still going. They're still going. We're fine. Okay, Wrath of Mars. Oh god. Mars is here. Uh, research completed. Ministorum mobilization. Uh, sacred Rite that increases the requisition output in cities. Very nice. So the rites of the Ecclesiarchy are not merely militaristic prayers and liturgies. Uh, uh, sorry, not merely militaristic. Prayers and liturgies exist for all functions of the Imperium. To be the focus of such a rite, whether uh, famulus or pronatus, or even the most base worker, drives them on to greater efforts. Totally. Uh, plus 20% requisitions for a turn. That's kind of awesome for the cost of 7.5 influence. 39 per turn now. That's awesome. That's going to be a huge help. Nice. Alright, let's move you there. 
we can one-shot this Iron Stride of Alistarius. Uh, you can move up here and heal them. And we should start getting the tanks rolling in. Okay, not completely healed, but that's okay. That's okay. Have you settled? Yeah, that is how much damage you're doing. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, that's weak. Alright, what are you going to do? could just stay standing here. Or I could just attack flimsily. It will attack flimsily. I might have them jump over into one of these spots later so I can push more units forward. Alright, you can heal for a little bit. How's that? Alright, you can grab this. And I suppose I'll shoot. Might as well, right? Might as well. Okay, now you lot can go and grab this. We have found the Crude Hounds. We can do some pretty good damage at a distance, but we can only kill a couple of them. So they can still come in and hurt us a fair bit. Alright, now these jerks. So it looks like we will need to use Sacral Vigor. Or Sacral, I don't know. One or the other. Both. <laughs> so that's pretty good. Uh, yeah, it doesn't look like we can kill um, all of these. But I can put them down to one. And I think if they're down to one, we'll probably be safe. That's what I'm going to assume. Good. Ugh. Montekai here, just bothering me. They really wanted to have this area, didn't they? They really did. The actual loyalty is really nice, too. This might actually be a good place to build an area as well. I don't suppose there's not great requisition around here. So yeah, I think I do want it down here for the requisition. I want to go a bit mad with the requisition. Though the loyalty is useful, because that does keep our stats up. This is lowering our output slightly. And we are starting to lose influence in this city, which is a bit weak. How about this one? They are gaining some here. Hmm, tough one. All right, let's loiter for a bit, maybe. Hang on, do we have something that puts up, um, uh, that one. All right, we're gonna, actually no, we need to get the healing in. All right, let's skip the city. I think we're good. Although, more exorcists are never a bad thing. And we are starting to earn a bit more now, so I think I will get one of those queued up. I think um, some Paragon War suits down here will help keep this whole area happy. We can push that up and break things um, from the south. I think that might be a better idea. Although, a similar amount of time. Probably want to go here first anyway. In that case, I think I might wait and just get another War suit on the go. Yeah. Alright. Never mind. Yeah, you guys chill. Choose research. Uh, well, actually, this one's probably a good idea. Get the Famulus mission. Because extra loyalty is sort of important at this point. Mortifiers would be nice too. We should probably think about that. Sisters of Repentia. The uh, Dialogus. I mean, there's a bunch of stuff that we haven't really picked up on yet. Castigators would be good. Just have a battle tank, you know? It's like a frontline tank. Celestian Sacrosancts with some frontline infantry as well. There's a lot of good stuff. I mean, obviously I want to get a Knight Lancer. But, as much as I want to rush the tech, I also want to see more that this faction has, you know? I haven't seen it all yet. I've skipped much of it. Okay. We lost two damage over there. Oh no. Zephyrim are taking a beating, that's fine. Oh, Zybertson. Fabulous mission. Diplomacy and subtlety are normally associated with the frothing fanatics of the Ecclesiarchy or the grim faith of the Battle Sisters, but those rare sisters who can charm and plot find themselves assigned to the Order's Famulus. They move with grace amongst the powerful of the Imperium, shifting their behaviour and breeding for the greater good of the Empire. Their extensive regular connections with the Inquisition come in useful when they encounter problems. Interesting. Interesting. Reminds me of um, uh, uh, Neferatus, like Lamian uh, vampire line in Warhammer Fantasy. 
sort of all, all spies, all just like, you know, in courts, sort of um, pulling strings. So that's fun. Uh, let's have a look. So yeah, we'll get Paragon War Suit from here. Good. We'll have that built soon. And down here, we need to build something. Which we can. Oh, good. That isn't getting any bonuses. Hang on. Well, I'm just going to build some here. I was going with energy, wasn't I, down here? Do I need that, though? I think we probably want something else. Could get something that gives us more influence. I do like that idea, actually. Because we are spending a lot of it at the moment. It's quite tempting. I might hold off for now. I think we'll go with more generators. I'll build one here, and then we'll do recruitment buildings there when I can afford it, because right now I cannot. Uh, but we can go with the extra requisition again. Really nice we can do that. We have hospitalers now, so we can have them move down here. They'll help us take this down. Um, I'm just going to leave this area, though. Not sure where to. Maybe just to here. And they can loiter for a bit. So we have this. Are we missing any other areas? I'm not sure we are. So actually, we can probably send a bunch of Battle Sisters back up here to help. I think, like, Battle Sisters aren't the best at taking down settlements, but if we have a bunch of Battle Sisters and some Hospitallers, if they only have, like, this city shooting at us, we can fight it forever. And just besieging it like that is better than not besieging it, you know? Let's finish them off. We also have the Cannoness now, to be honest. I think we'll move her up as well. A little worried about going that way, but I'm going to do it anyway. I'm going to ignore this for now. And yeah, we need to attack all this area, don't we? So let's heal you. And I'm not sure what to do with them, you know? I'm not sure what to do with this effort. In. Not really. All right, we're going to throw him over here. It's probably going to be a bit silly. Uh, I'm going to throw a melter bomb at this guy. I think we're going to blow these guys up with the exorcist. But we're going to move the war suits over here, and they are going to try and help deal with this jerk. So, light of the emperor. I mean, that's not terrible, I guess. Not awful. Um, that's not going to be a bad initial hit. Move these battle sisters up. We can move you up and get some damage in there too. Yeah, I think we're just going to attack normally there. I think that's fine. Not bad. Not bad damage. Uh, Set, so you head south. Uh, so we'll deal with this. How long before we get the Paragon War suits? Eight. God, we really do need more production, don't we? Sure do. Uh, let's do that then. Or do I need to get the extra vigor? Probably not, right? Oh, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Found some of them in Crute Hounds. Nice. I should have given myself more accuracy to see if I could actually kill them. It's fine. We'll keep trying to find them. Uh, okay, so what we can do is go with the Mechanized Wrath for the Hangers. Yeah, okay, let's do that. We'll probably get that, um... Yeah, we're gonna get the lightning long before the Paragon War suit, but that can come help smash things, blow things up. Maybe help up here. Help somewhere. So, Hammer of Wrath... will help the Zephyrim and the Paragon War suits. So that I like. It lets them get bonus, um... melee damage, which I like uh, quite a lot. Although... Is there anything we want to fill in first? I know there's not missing units. I'm not sure I really want to prioritize them, but I would like to see them before the end, you know? Um, but I'm sure we'll fill in all this tech by the time we finish. We are still nowhere near finishing this campaign. That I'm certain of. So, okay. That'll do. Okay, they just churned down another couple of units. These Zephyrim are in a lot of trouble. But that was, you know, relatively intentional. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're coming for us again. Jerks. Alright, the Cannoness needs to get 
to a Hospitaller who is nowhere near. So they are both piranhas. Oh, they're getting those rockets in as well. Okay, now where do those dogs go? All the way over there, really? My word. Okay. Well, damn. I do need to try and chase them down. It's the thing. Alright, you go hang out there. Oops. Hello, hospitalers. Let's get you down here as well. Now you... Do I want to pull back to the city? Maybe. Maybe, actually. If they want to start pushing towards me, I'll push... Uh, I'll pull back and let them. Okay, I need to shoot from here if I want to get rid of them, so that's fine. Uh, I can start shooting the settlement if I want. That will start lowering uh, their production and the like. So I think it's worthwhile, but I also want to get rid of this tech priest. Alright, we're going to attack there. Going to move the war suits up. Can't quite finish them. Can't quite. But I might be able to with these battle sisters. So let's do that. Okay, that'll finish him. Um, so crack grenade and six damage. I mean, we're basically doing as much damage without the crack grenade. I think maybe we just shoot. Now we have a hospitalers who I could move up. I'm a little worried about the combined attacks there, though. But I do want to get them up here to the Zephyr. But I think they're going to focus on the war suits pretty shortly. But hey, look, we're starting to do some damage, and that is awesome. That's a big deal. So let's get more production. I'm going to keep doing that. Okay, has everyone else moved? Uh, Hospitalists haven't, of course. I'm going to try the Endless Crusade. Can I get over there if I do that? I can. Excellent. Well. Thank the Emperor for that, I suppose. Good job. Nice. That's so handy. Uh, okay, so that's all good, but let's uh, up production for the ones that we're building. I want these units out as quickly as possible. They're really going to swing things for us. Uh, then, of course, you know, we also have Celestine, but we want to get even more Hospitalers um, built. So that's nearly done. So what are we going to do after that? Are we going to get, like, I don't know, another Ecclesiarchal? Might be worthwhile. Another hangar might be worthwhile, honestly. Maybe I'll do that. Or get more research. I think that would also be quite nice. That was kind of the plan, right? They really hate doctors. Hate them. Why? Because the flesh is weak. Why would you treat the flesh when you could be better? Huh? Oh, hello. Hi there. Well, we've got an overwatch. I think we throw grenades at them. We can probably take these two out pretty quickly. Provided no one... D all right. <laughs> Might take a little longer. Uh, all right, you can not shoot that for some reason. You can never shoot anything. Our cities are so bad at shooting things. Uh, so huge amount of damage there, which is nice. Melter bomb. We'll destroy it. We'll crack grenade. Okay, we'll have to go with the melter then. Let's do that. And get a melter there? I can, but I'm better off just attacking him. But not bad. Not bad. Feels good getting rid of them. Now, where the hell did those dogs go? Nope, didn't find them. Might be up here. Like in this area. But can't be completely sure. Hang on a minute. Is this actually the edge of the map? Because it looks like there's another tile. I think that's just how the edge of the map looks. Anyway. Uh, you can produce an exorcist, I've decided. You're welcome. Uh, more mobilization, please. And let's keep rushing mechanized wrath. I want these things built. <gasps> we can have a lightning. We can have a lightning next turn. That feels good. Love a good lightning. 
Uh, so you're not able to get anywhere. Let's see. Uh, you should probably heal yourself. I can do 21 damage to this thing. Every attack. That's amazing. Alright, you can get over here. And 18 with that as well. But yeah, I want these dead. And we can finish them off with the Zephyrim. Uh, you can't go that far, but you're getting in there. That's what matters. As far as you can't attack him from there. But that's okay. Melter Bomb. It's not a terrible idea, is it? Or I could just attack and they could attack. I mean, obviously destroying this Forge Temple would be great. In fact, it would be great. I'm going to blow it up. And let's get that Melter Bomb in there. And I'm going to be selfish and have them heal themselves instead of these Zephyrim. Uh, we don't Divine Guidance as well. Which is nice. So we could use that soon. Thanks for armor penetration things. Start attacking this temple symbol. But uh, yeah, we're doing well. We're doing well. This is a big deal. I forget how cities work for this faction. I don't know if they just build tool or if they have sev like several um, settlements. Can't remember. Been too long since I played them. That and I've only played one campaign with the minute because they were the last DLC. So that's the only campaign I played with the minute was the one I was playing. So I haven't sort of encountered them a bunch of times with other folks to be like, oh yeah, and they have this thing. Oh nice. There we go. I don't know why it wasn't triggering. I left clicked first and I was like, what do I actually right click for items? And I right clicked and it didn't do anything and I left clicked and it worked the second time. This is very odd. But hey, we took out the two piranhas. And we still have all of our flesh. So that's pretty good. Nice. Alright, so guys, we have made excellent progress uh, in this episode. You know, we're finally taking the fight to Mechanicus. Um, production's going great. We've got some great tech. Uh, we've cleaned up most of the back line now. We have actually survived the invasion. We just need to wait for Celestine to show up, which will be uh, in five turns. So we'll have another Paragon Warsuit, um, you know, squadron. Don't know what you'd call a group of Warsuits. I guess you just called them Warsuits. But anyway, we'll have a bunch of Paragon Warsuits and uh, a Lightning before we get her out. So that's really good. But yeah, we're making progress. We are smashing these guys to bits and they have nothing that can stand against us. Stuff that's getting damaged is getting healed and we're laughing, guys. It's looking great. So guys, if you enjoyed this, comment, like, subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys.